What's the male equivalent of a girl borrowing a guy's hoodie? In my high school there was a weird thing when boys would take their GFS bra strap and put it on their wrists. When I had that trash bag bun hairstyle coincidentally also back in HS I used to take my GFS hair ties. I managed to snatch that lit ass phone cord hair tie and oh boy it was a game changer lmao I kept using it until I got rid of that stupid bun. Borrowing shampoo, and beauty products in general, if she's cool with it, of course. Shout out to the ladies though, your shits are fire. I ran out of deodorant one day and borrowed hers. I legit smells heavenly throughout the day, even after sweating my ass off at the gym. After that day, I've been using mostly women products, except cologne. As someone who just recently had a hoodie stolen let her wear it while we were chilling at my place. Let her keep it PC I figured I'd get it back later and then she ghosted me the next day I don't think there's any legal recourse a man could take that would equally quantify how it feels to get your fucking hoodie stolen. Ex-girlfriend is Chinese. The way I knew the relationship was serious was when the hot water dispenser showed up on my counter and there was a small rice cooker in my cupboard. The way I knew the relationship was over is when those two items disappeared. My boyfriend kept a ring I wore over to his place one week and a super cheap one that I'd barely wear anyway and strung it on a necklace chain that he wears frequently. Simple action but absolutely adorable to me, I love seeing him wear it. I borrowed my ex's hoodie as well. I'm already a tall dude, but he was towering over me. And yes, I understand why the fuck you do it. Not only is it comfy as hell. Walking around in something that smells after your partner is the best. My big one is sweatpants. I'm not a very tall guy and like 5 feet 7 inches and for some reason in the past my exes have been taller than me or just the same height. I love being comfy as fin girls have the best baggy sweatpants. I'd have to say probably borrowing my wife's hoodies. We're the same size, and we share most of our wardrobe. But there's just something so enjoyably comfortable about wearing a hoodie that smells like my wife. There is a scene in the movie Bull Durham where Kevin Costner is wearing Susan Sarandon's bathrobe while they're dancing and eating cereal. One of the best scenes in one of the best baseball movies ever made. Pretty sure it was wearing their knickers panties under your work clothes. It was definitely a meme a few years ago. And David Beckham got called out in the newspapers for it even longer ago. Always using the many disinfectant napkins and etc. paraphernalia that they carry, despite never carrying any in my day-to-day -day life as a single dude ever. As a guy with long hair, it's borrowing hair bands. I only bring the one and I always lose it. Don't know how women eat them with long hair that's down. Look, it said coconut honey vanilla orange body butter on the bottle. So how could I resist trying to eat your expensive body wash? I used linoleum cream on my nipples when I was breastfeeding our daughter and my BF used to use it as lip balm. It worked very well. Their Tupperware to-go containers when they make you food or leftovers. It's their way of taking care of you in a little way. My husband wears my shirts if that counts. He is significantly smaller than me though so they look like dresses on him. For me with my GF is I borrow her hair bands that she forgets at my house and use them as bracelets. Asking her to hold something in her purse maybe? But honestly my GF makes me hold her stuff all the time. Me using her moisturizer or other beauty products. All straight men who are honest are guilty of this. Playing Jaws or Pac-Man with one of her hair clips that look like it has really long teeth. Well, like a hoodie, you have a lot more of them than you need but they're a lot less visible. Using our good, expensive body products. You all don't even use the right amount half the time. Trying out some of the skin products. Finding it makes no difference other than smell. In high school, it was taking a pair of her panties to hang from your rearview mirror. LOL. Lotion. I get the cheap stuff so my winter skin doesn't burn when I get in the shower. Borrowing the hoodie she forgot to return to the guy she was seeing before you. Wearing her lace underwear because you like the way they feel on your balls. Sticking his foot up her pussy and wearing her around like a slipper. Not exactly the same but maybe stealing her underwear as a memento. Eating the other half of the cookie she was going to come back to. I get in trouble for eating my wife's leftover food quite often. My husband keeps stealing my snug rug blanket with sleeves. Eating the last slice of leftover pizza in her refrigerator. You already know I'm using that high-end facial moisturizer. Wearing her panties on my head like a beanie when I go out. Seems like a lot of guys are borrowing their girl's money. She made me lunch. I use this Tupperware exclusively now. Getting the hoodie back and it smells like her perfume. Borrowing her thongs for a cheeky night out on the town. During the skinny jeans fad, it was stealing her jeans. Using her cucumber melon dove deodorant. So I've heard. Easily using her shampoo body wash in the shower lamel. My husband is regularly stealing my pajama bottoms. A guy borrowing his boyfriend's hoodie. 
obviously.